Oh, sh**. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. <laughs> oh, yeah? Spider. Okay. Spider. We bring you this pause, or I, I'll just stop. The, this is a throwaway episode. Okay. Maybe. Hi. We're Hi. back. <laughs> uh, Jen wanted me to deal with a spider. James and I had two different thought processes. <laughs> <laughs> he came out with a fly swatter, and I was like, no, no, dude, just get a cub. Just put it outside and set it free. <laughs> I was like, die, motherfucker. Come into my house, you get fucking squished. I said smacked. <laughs> She's like, come into my house, get smacked. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's the kind of person I am. I, I don't like to kill bugs. I'll kill them if they're like eye level, but this motherfucker was like way above me. Uh, I try okay. and grab that bitch, she's gonna fucking... You mean you free them if they're eye level? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if he's up higher than me, that motherfucker's coming down on my hair. No thanks. Mm. You remember that, have you ever heard that, that theory that like, when you sleep, a spider it comes will, in your comes mouth in your every mouth. single day? I do, is it, that's not true. Nah, no, it's a myth. That has to be a myth. Uh, though, you are supposedly, like, you do swallow spiders at night sometimes. Apparently. What about, why is it always spiders? What about other bugs? Probably other bugs, too. Oh, wait, right. They're... <laughs> um, shit, so I'm, I'm gonna tell a couple stories. One, yeah. I'll come back to this one. I got a new phone. Yeah. Two, uh, I have some sad news. I've been wanting to get a new TV for a while. I think I may have mentioned that on show before. Like, I got one, and I had to fucking return it, and it was a nightmare. Um... You want to just put it at the foot of your bed so you could watch TV while you're A second you're in bed. TV. We've decided against having a second TV. But the, I was going to upgrade my current TV, which is still a pretty nice TV. But yeah. fuck it. I was like, I want a nicer TV. Uh, do I only have one life left? Uh, no, you just collected one. Okay, nice cool. level. So, I was going to get this. Uh, the TV I want is the LG B, whatever, B7. It's like uh -huh. a 65 inch OLED from last year. And uh, Wally World, Walmart, was selling them refurbished for a good price. They're pretty cheap. Oops. Oops. <laughs> and so uh, I bought it. And it's way bigger than my little tiny car will fit. So I had to borrow my parents' uh, big ass uh, like utility van kind of looking thing. It's not a utility van, but it's big. And uh, I... Like, the parking spot outside my apartment is really fucking small, and their car is massive, and our uh, the neighbors who park next to us, they have a bigger car, so they have to park kind of on the edge. Uh -oh. So I was, like, fucking parking the car. I realized it wasn't going to fit, so I, like, I paused for a second. I put on the brakes. I, like, put it in park. I sit for a second. I'm like, okay, I'm going to get out of the car and see how far I have until I, uh, like, hit this post here so I can back out and fix this. Fucking get out of the car, and the car moves forward a foot, and I just hear and it just fucking scrapes the side of the goddamn super nice like big van it's not a van it's like a, an suv like this super nice suv um like, oh you have to be crashing that level oh hmm. well it's just auto swap me yeah. yeah and uh yeah dude so it just fucking <laughs> scratch up the super nice fucking car oh hey oh sweet it's the level that you kind of wanted to play hell maybe. yeah boy go oh, get him I'm Here taking you to the bayou, motherfucker. Squeal like a piggy. <laughs> um, so yeah, dude, I put this fucking six inch gash on my parents' super nice fucking SUV. Nah. And so then I had to cancel the, uh, my TV so I could help pay for the damages that nah. I caused. And it's really after- that expensive? Nope. After insurance finally, uh, like got back about it and stuff, it, I only had to pay like 250 bucks. Because the oh. scrape wasn't very big, so I didn't even need to fucking cancel my TV. <laughs> Why? So, oh, so you could have just waited. Yep, but I didn't want to. I wanted to do the responsible thing and like make sure I had the money to pay for the shit I wrecked. But how ironic is that? I borrowed their car because I needed it to get the TV. Uh, but if I didn't borrow their car, I could still have my TV. Elliot, fucker. What I'm about to say. Now I'm sure that is a very annoying thing, the fact that you just decided to pay the extra pay the money and then you found out later that you didn't have to pay as much money. Yep. When really all you had to do was wait. Oh, I'm yeah. sure that's really fucking annoying. Regardless Fucker. Motherfucker! Fucking dig nut! Regardless, I am still going to say this. Are you ready? No. How my name's Elliot, I jumped the gun! How my name's Elliot, I jumped the gun! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just that's thought beautiful. I'd say that. Thank you. <laughs> 
I didn't know if that, that would... motherfucker every time. That I didn't know if that would make you mad or not. I was like, eh. if I say this, will Ellie be like, James? That's not fucking funny. This this is a situation where it's not fucking funny. I'd be like, oh, I'm sorry. No, dude, I have, <laughs> I have pretty thick skin. Yeah, you do. But... I think it's fucking hilarious. I fucking wrecked. The... I was telling you about it on the phone, and I was telling you how fucking funny I thought, like how ironic it was that I borrowed their car to get my TV, and then yeah, I fucked yeah. up their car, and God. What the fuck? You can't jump over them, dude. You just have to plan out where they're gonna be. Really? You gotta plan out where they're not going to be, so you can... Mm. Jesus. Yeah, it's tricky. Left! I know. Yeah, thank nice you, thing. thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome. Yeah, this level's freaking hard, but there's but there's later ones. Bitch ass! <laughs> there's later ones that are even harder. Jesus. Where you have to ride the piggy. Ride the piggy, boy! Dude, I really wish I could do Pumbaa's voice. Yeah? His voice is hard to do. I just... I don't know, maybe it's just me, but... I hit jump. I fucking <laughs> hit jump. <laughs> I, I just wish I could. The guy who can do Pumbaa's voice, man. He's a lucky man. Okay. You got this. What if he, like, lost all his family in a fire? Pfft, who fucking cares? He, he can do Pumbaa's voice. <laughs> Doesn't fucking matter. Who needs family and friends when you, you, you're a fucking Disney star? Hell yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Like, I, I can kind of do Timon's voice. Like, hey, Pumba. Motherfucker! Why? When he was a young warthog. Very nice. <laughs> I can kind of do that, but nope, not Pumba. Did you know Pumba translates to simpleton? Shitlord. <laughs> it ah. means simpleton in Swahili. Cool. Rafiki means friend. Sim Elliot means dumbass. Yeah, naturally. And uh, Simba means lion. Ah! Does it? Yeah, did, did you know Shere Khan? Oh god, Jesus Christ. Nice job, dude. Thank Sweet. you. Shere Khan actually translates to Lion King. Oh. So Shere Khan from the Jungle Book, his literal English name is Lion King. Sick. Yeah. It's cool, man. Yeah. Dude. Interesting. Oh yeah, fuck. Um, we also, uh, I got a new phone. Yes, you did. Uh, dude, my phone, I had the Google Pixel XL. And it was going great for like two years or so. I almost had it for two years. I got it on like day one. And um, it was fine up until the end. And then it just started shitting out on me the last couple months. Like it would just lock up all the time. Mm -hmm. And uh, I was coming home from vacation and it locked like maybe three or four times while driving in the car. And I needed oh. the GPS. And I was just like, fuck this shit. So we got home and I just fucking, oops. <laughs> So I just went to the, uh... I'm an I jumped again. Yeah, baby. You know what? I can't keep saying that. That's your shtick. That's my shtick, baby. I can't steal it from you. Anyways, continue, wow. please. Uh, so I just, like, on a whim went out and got this new phone. And I'm liking it quite a bit. But it's prone to scratches, man. I got the Galaxy S9. This motherfucker without a case in three days, the back has tons of micro scratches. Nah, that blows. Now that I have it in a case, it's totally fine. All right, but, good. Um, <sighs> buyer be warned. Yeah, dude, I I've learned that you absolutely need to get a new get a safe case when you buy a Nowadays. new phone. Yeah, cuz I remember when Pokémon Go first came out, uh -huh. I I would, you know, you, you can like keep turn the phone off, turn the screen off and keep it the phone in your pocket uh -huh. while you walk around and then it'll vibrate when a Pokémon appears, but I would like to play just holding my hand watching the screen while I walk like, okay, I just need yeah. to go this way. I freaking dropped my phone when I was Ooh. walking on a road and <laughs> bad crack on the screen so I got uh, I think I think I got it fixed but then I I was like okay time to get an otter box so that shit doesn't happen again oh, you're one of those nerds yep I got an otter box for my Android phone gross it was, it's very useful I don't like those really yeah they they uh if like they had words attached to them it would just be turbo nerd uh, okay they're just ugly. But you are a turbo nerd. I am a turbo nerd. So wouldn't that fit? No, I'm a different kind of turbo nerd. Oh, you're a sexy I'm a turbo sexy nerd. motherfucker. You're a smexy turbo nerd. Hell yeah. <laughs> you're a smexican. Smexican. <laughs> you're a smart, sexy Mexican. <laughs> yeah. Smexy, smexy. Yeah, baby. Uh-oh. Oh! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Here's Johnny! <laughs> what? <laughs> From The Shining? Yeah, I know, but... Uh oh. Fucking. Fucking taint. Sloppy taint. Wait. Women have taints, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. I, I guess. I didn't Just know. <laughs> be the part in between your cooter and your fucking, uh, shitbox. Yeah. 
I had a feeling. I don't know. I feel like normally people refer to Tanto as just men's. Yeah, why is that? Why is what? Why, why, why do people usually just refer to it as, like, only speak about guys' taints? At I least. don't know, because ball sacks are fucking nasty. I mean, fucking vaginas gotta be fucking nasty, too, to keep that fucking cooter all day. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> yeah, Coco would understand. Yeah, She's baby. gotta keep it from being lit on fire. And keep the turtles from walking inside her vagina, you know? Oh, yeah. I can can you land on that fire thing? Yes. Oh. When, it, when the fire's not off, obviously. Oh. That's probably what I was supposed to do. Got it. Nice, dude. <laughs> mm. Yeah, you don't get a double jump in until Crash 2, unfortunately. Ah. Yeah. One life? Yeah, you'll be fine, though. You better not fuck this up. I think. <laughs> Let's see. Some of the later wall levels like this, holy shit, they're hard. Yeah. Dude, not not to bring politics too much into this, but I bet when Donald Trump is done building that wall, I bet he's gonna design it like this, where like if people want to get through it illegally, they have to jump across a labyrinth like this, jump over fire and shit. <laughs> <laughs> if if he built a wall. It, it, well, if he built it, yeah. I mean, if, if I were in charge of building a wall like that, I'd totally make it like this. <laughs> Uh-oh. Motherfucker, I landed on his head! Okay, I think you got... Oh, no, you're safe. You just got another life. Damn tootin'. Should we see if you survive before we... <laughs> Final life. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, you fucker. You fuck! Watch the... What? I wasn't even over it! Next time on Royal Goobs. Wait, Sorry. wait, wait, wait for this. Game over. That is the coolest game over screen ever! Ah.